click on settings, recording, and again, there are two options, automatic or custom settings. And here are the options to split the recording by file size or duration and the multi-track audio. If you enable this option, your microphone and system audio will be separated in different tracks. This will help you to remove the microphone while editing. And from here, you select where your recordings will be saved. These options here are general for the recording, no matter if you use the automatic or custom settings. Let's go to the custom options. First is the resolution. Select the one you like. Then the codec. Very important. You need to set the right codec the same as the streaming one because you won't get a warning sign here telling you that, for instance, this is not the best codec for you. So make sure to select the correct one. Then select the codec preset for you. There might be different options. Then select the frame rate and the quality. You have the option from this standard, high, very high, ultra high. These are the options according to my GPU or the codec that I'm using for you. These options might be different. And again, these options are the general for the recording, as I said, no matter if you choose automatic or custom.